I like you. So right behind you guys is the play area. Every day, these guys are taken out by our volunteers, and they're allowed to exercise. And play. How old is this one? He is 16 months old. Oh, Mama, do get out of the garbage. Excuse me. I have a crazy dog. They're very soft. Aren't they? It's soft so cute. And sweet. <laughs> soft. Is he a three-toed or a two-toed sloth? Two-toed. Okay. Two-fingered. Two I see. Both species of. So, what part of him is paralyzed? Is his back legs or? Because he seems like he's strong. Like this, and shift his weight so that one leg hooks. And then That's the other cool. Legs. It's amazing, yeah. That's amazing. Mm -hmm. Hi, Velcro. Hi, buddy. So he's a very young baby. He's um six months old. This guy is seven months old. The roommate Rolo is upstairs in the nursery. The little tiny ones sleep upstairs. It's actually sleep in incubators, if you can believe that. Oh, so it's warmer. Mm -hmm. Does that seem like their mom's warmth, I guess? Or well, it's just they need these extra animals help. need extra help. These animals are mammals, like us humans, but they're unable to regulate their own body temperatures. And if they can't stay warm, to digest. Okay, one full month. Inside that four-chambered stomach are enzymes, bacteria, and fermentation. What happens if the animal is exposed to cold temperatures for very, very long, the bacteria will die off. Oh. If the bacteria dies off, they're unable to digest, and they will slowly starve to death. That's crazy. That is crazy. So if, uh, if a mother falls... <coughs> The mother falls to the floor and is unable to get back up. Her body temperature will drop too low, and and she will end up starving to death. That happens too often. Oh wow! Oh, so parking so what what temperature do they have to be most of the time? Like 80? Or? When we go back inside to see the adults, I have a little chart that tells you what their body temperature is, what it ranges between. Oh cool! It's lower than any other mammal. Oh. And what's amazing is their body temperature can fluctuate 10 degrees above and below normal, without doing really so big, you know. Oh, yeah. Oh, wow. She was about less than a week old when she put the stethoscope. Oh, you can? You can hear it, yes. And there's a probiotic, it's a paste, that you can give this animal to reactivate its gut bacteria. Oh, in case it, wow. In case it stops functioning. What is the probiotic? It's called Benabac. Anyway, so for many, many years, people thought that there was only one animal out there, and they named it the sloth. When they finally realized that they were looking at two different animals, you know. They thought, no, we're going to leave it as it was, yeah. it's the sloth. Well, the sloths are so different from each other. I mean, you're, you're, you're growing at ants. So, uh, think of... Oh, yeah. <laughs> what happened?